Welcome back to more triangle strategy. In the last video, we did the side A of this choice. Where we turned down Tellior. And, uh... He immediately came back and attacked us. With a hired hand known as the Hero's Bane, Rufus. Um, we had a very intense battle. But we were able to stomp him out. Now, we are going to see the flip side of this scenario and what would have happened if we had decided to go with Roland's gut. Um, it was Roland, Anna, and Iridor. In short, you wish for the three high houses to join hands and fight the duchy. Is that correct, Lord Silvio? Indeed. I believe it our duty to fight. Some are frozen in fear, trembling at the mere thought of the Duchy's power. I feel that joining the three high houses under a single flag is the only way to unite them. My men ready themselves for war as we speak. Come to Telior, and we can strike at Esros together. Prince Roland will be safe with us, of course. It's as good a plan as any. You have my thanks for getting the preparations underway. I wonder if Lord Landroy would agree. I doubt House Falks would refuse a fight. Their devotion to the Crown knows no bounds. But of course, they reaped great rewards from the bountiful lands won during the war. You propose reuniting the three high houses who led the Salt Iron War to its end. It is heartening to know you would once again lend us your strength. We certainly could use all the help we can get. Though I wish we could resolve matters peacefully. You speak as though your brother is not at fault for all this. My bride-to-be bears no blame for the Duchy's actions. Uh, my apologies. Forgive me for my outburst. But we haven't much time. I would have your answer now. Shall we accept Lord Silvio's proposal, my lord? Fetch the scales, Benedict. We shall decide our path together. Each dot's like a sledgehammer slam to the head. Anyway. <clears throat> so obviously in this one, we know what we're doing. We know what we're deciding. We're going to try and dissuade all three of these ladies. I used the wrong word. We're going to try and persuade them, not dissuade them. They are already dissuaded. <laughs> Although, I'd be curious to see Huets. Oh, my nose is... Ah, I missed. It's the first one I've missed all morning. Uh, that tissue's going into the trash can, by the way. That's what I'm missing. Um, I can understand Frederica and Gila, like, agreeing on this, but Huet, I wonder what's Huet's reasoning for disagreeing with Roland. Either way, all you have to do is, uh, persuade Benedict and you're good. Honestly, you could get through the whole entire game just by persuading the undecided member and calling it a day. That's a fact. No, stop it. Um, we told them to reconcile last time. <laughs> we'll go with the bottom one this time. You have a point there, my lord. Staying together may just make things worse in the end. Even if their marriage is over, that doesn't mean it's the end. I pray my daughter will find happiness no matter who, what she chooses, who she chooses. 
Thank you, Lord. Sorry, no. I feel so much better now that we've spoken. I apologize for burdening you with my family's troubles, especially at a time like this. You need to apologize. My family is perfect. It's about to that same thing, though. Yeah, you're just gonna spout out how you're happy I didn't burn your house down. Which, yeah, you're welcome. I could have. It would have been cool, too. What? You know what they say, cooler heads prevail. You know, I never actually noticed that one. Okay, so none of you losers actually give me any new information. information yeah very unloyal person but you didn't help out with your door and I thought it would That's right. <clears throat> um, it doesn't matter how well connected you are, to be honest. It's gonna. It's not gonna stop you from being crushed. It's just gonna delay you from being crushed. So with that being said, I refuse to do any other except for the bottom one. Because the top one's just a lie. I would never admit there is anything I can learn from Silvio. <clears throat> and I believe that's everything out here. Just fine and dandy. Yep. Awful I am at persuading these girls. I start with you at the only one I'm interested in. I know we need all the help we can get, but even so I cannot find it in the trust house tell your and you're right about that, but you know, I gotta prove Pray tell Lord Sereno, what do you think of Lord Silvio's offer? Um, an alliance between the high houses would raise the soldiers' morale. All the more so knowing Telior is prepared for battle. I would be grateful and support considering those who would aid us now are few and far between. The greater our forces, the better. We may finally be able to catch our breath if we have more soldiers. Quite true. I feel like the morale boost might... Yeah. Truth be told, though, I have my reservations about who devised the entire then plan. If you don't mind my asking, what makes you sure we should ally with them? <laughs> um, the repeated battles are taking a toll on the domain. I would ask for Hostelio's support to ease the suffering of my people. There is no telling when Ace Frost will strike us at us again. We must take every measure we can to be prepared. Ace Frost has placed a bounty on Roland's head. The more allies we have, the safer he would be. That is... Not necessarily true, but... <sighs> I 
Here's my biggest issue with Teliors plan. Why does it have to be in the Teliour domain? Just saying. Why not Fox? Why not bring his people to the Wolfheart? Considering the Wolfheart domain has heavily been considered the most impregnable stronghold outside of the castle. Yeah. So, why go to Teliord? Why go to Fox? Why not bring them to the Wolfheart domain? It just makes more sense. Yeah, like, group up, team up. But, Tellior hasn't proven himself faithful enough. Okay. But I feel like throwing Roland in her face might be the guilt trip we need. I share your concerns, but I cannot... Oof. Okay, maybe not. I have chosen. Yep, indifferent. That is such a bull. What do you need? I hear that Taylor domain is known for its wine and not warriors. It makes me wonder if it is truly necessary for us to join forces at a time like this. I would no qualms if Lord Silvio were a man of upstanding character, but the rumors I hear only speak to the contrary. The more allies one can avail themselves to, the better. That being said, an untrustworthy ally avails no one. Would you not agree? Ugh. We must first and foremost address the supply shortage House Teliord could help us there. The paths before us are now... The paths before us are now regrettably few, but new allies will open up new paths. Because I don't want to agree he's desperate, because I know he's not. It's more of a means to an end, essentially. The only thing... The, the biggest thing I disagree about this plan in general... Is moving us to tell yours domain it's just senseless yeah <coughs> Jesus we've got forces are dwindling um, address supply shortage and opens up new options, new paths. I think I'll go with the top one. Uh huh. I don't like how she said that. It is better to act than react. I respect the leader with such a provocative stance. All right. Okay, bread to be. Do you think allying yourself to Pastelior would stop the spread of war? I... No. It makes me wonder if it'd only be pouring oil on fire. Technically, yeah, you're right, but it's not the point. The point is, I need to see what happens in this path. <laughs> An alliance between the high houses would lift the people's spirit, something sorely needed in times like this. It would be boon to soldiers and civilians alike of Tellyard would grant us food and positions. Our forces need the help they can get. I believe has Tellyard could provide us with such meaning of relief on the battlefield. I do not believe they could relieve us on the battlefield. <laughs> but maybe that one. I've heard that the domain is famed for its produce, grapes most prominently, and they and any aid they could give us would be most welcome. I see. Is there something about House Tellier that concerns you, Frederica? 
there is indeed, I cannot help but wonder what those servitors true intentions are. If Ace Frost has some part of play to play in this. Yeah. Yeah, let me just Yeah, there is a chance the the Duchy has already recruited us earlier to the cause. Yeah, that's gonna get her on your side. Freaking idiot. <laughs> that's not gonna convince her to change her mind. Ace Frost will likely strike at us before we know it. They are not the type to wallow in defeat. I mean, have you met Talion? I think he's exactly the kind of man who would wallow in defeat. Uh, I don't know. It's one of these two. Obviously, that third one is just damning evidence. Oh. Uh, the middle one? Truly. It would not be unthinkable for Ace Frost to use their might to force them into submission or win them over in the, with the promise to I do see. war. <laughs> so basically, I just talk to her and be like, hey, there's there's still a chance we, we're the first ones to meet Lord him. Serenella. I know. I know. Now Lance was certainly worthy considering. Pray tell me what sage you is, my lord. Uh, I would welcome any help to get out of protecting Prince Roland. The crown city has fallen, making the movements of the high house is more important than ever. 24th. Nope. No matter the course, we will need greater numbers to see you through joining hand. Sure. And? Uh, I would ally with him to ensure our survival. I am certain both his house's might and their name would serve as well. I would... Do all I could to better our situation, even if just a little. To that end, an alliance would be most welcome. <laughs> I do not intend to put my blind trust in Lord Silvio as we are now, though it is an offer we cannot refuse. I like the middle one. Perhaps, but if so. Nice, nice. That's it. I don't need to talk to you guys. <laughs> You guys are already on my side. So let's see how bad I did. Because I, um, I, I know I didn't get you at. Just like I know I didn't get Eridor. I think they intentionally make it extremely easy to persuade the House Tellier's item. proposal or go our own way? Approach the scales of conviction. Your token at the ready. Forgive me, my lord. Oh, no! Even still. Oh, no. If I didn't get Gila, I don't have this. I have no qualms with that. Oh, I, we, we're good. We only need one. I know I didn't get you. You were indifferent. Please forgive me. So I, I, I got one. All right, that's the first time I failed an undecided. Scales of so. conviction will illuminate the path we've chosen. So close. How did I fail and undecided? Man, and I, th I, th I thought I had Frederico with the, the whole uh, food thing. 
Come on. The way forward is decided. We join forces with House Tellior and defy the Duchy's wrath. Not as successful as my other one, though. <laughs> That's for sure. Which is funny because I thought it'd be easier to persuade people on this path than the other one. Boy, was I wrong? Huzzah! The tidings of our alliance will no doubt bring relief to the aching hearts of our people. Now then, Prince Rowan, you and all of House Warford simply must come to Talior. We shall. Thank you. You needn't worry about a thing. Leave everything in my capable hands. I must make haste to Talior. I shall throw a grand banquet to commemorate the occasion. You don't have to do that. This is hardly the time for celebrations. Is something on your mind, Benedict? No, my lord. Liar. Bro, if you got a bad feeling, just tell me, man. I'm a man. No. I do not want to save. Lord Silvio of Tellior offers the solitary House Wolfort an ally, and a place of protection for Roland. Serenoa accepts his offer, and Silvio puts his plan to ensnare his new allies into motion. Hey, spoiler. Jeez. Sleep with one eye open. Rude. Oh, we still see the same where Rufus. No, no, spare me! I beg you. That's enough, Rufus. You call these men soldiers, Silvio? They haven't got any spine. You can take your frustrations out on House Warfort. They accepted my gracious offer. I would have preferred they hadn't. I hate dirty jobs. I expect double for this one. And you shall have it. You will strike once the banquet is finished. Only Roland need live. Good luck with that one, bud. I will say, I am pretty intrigued to explore uh, Oh yeah, Medina Let's just get her story out of the way with Get her in our party Skip I've already seen it If you want to watch this, go watch the other video I beg your I still don't get this guy. My here. name is Medina. What insolence is this? I, I still don't get that comment right there. Wait, why is he offended? I don't. Stand I don't understand it. Pray. It is sad. It is. Then, I, I cannot. Pray it's not like she's the first woman to join our ranks, man. The scales, when decision. You mean? That is all. Then. If you would. I would be. Let us I am at your Thank you. Shut up. Yep. She's a medicinal healer. I think these two are the same. Sir, give me one more chance. I shall not fail again. We are already taking measures against House Wolford. A suitable pawn has showed itself before us. 
Though, perhaps, I should be more wary of my own family than any other. Huh? Fox is all that remains of the three high houses. I trust you know what to do, Evelora. Lord Landroy Fox is famed for his bow arm. He had the pluck to fire at your master during the war. Do you think you can best him? Without a doubt. And let me guess, you guys, yep. The roof is a, roof is, Travis, Travis and Trish. It's weird that you can only get one, but not the other. I don't know what to expect now that S. Frost has taken over Glenbrook. Don't think about it. I heard they put a huge bounty on the prince's head. Did they? We can make a killing if we catch him. He certainly kicked your ass in the beginning of the game. I always dreamed of kidnapping royalty. <laughs> but the prince of a crumbling kingdom... You tried you tried kidnapping royalty at the very beginning of the game. What are you talking about? They'd probably kill him if we turn him over. They want him alive. I mean they'd eventually kill him, yeah. The reward is tempting though. It's a reward. It's a reward, man. That's the whole point of a reward. The reward is tempting though. Parrot? Those two are stupid. By the way, Avlora can only be unlocked if you get the true ending. I think that's dumb. It is what it is. So, Lord Silvio has been in contact with Esfrost. I heard he made for Whitehome Castle not long ago. And I received identical reports from several of our spies in Tellior. Oh, they have spies in Tellior. Nice. There is a reason he is known as an opportunist. In which case, he has but one objective. Securing Prince Roland to use as leverage with Esfrost. I was also told that House Tellior has hired a man named Rufus as a bodyguard. What do you know about this man? He's a bounty hunter known as Hero's Bane, loyal to none but coin. That said, he's a ruthless fighter. It would be wise not to underestimate him. To think Lord Sylvia would hire such a man. It means he is serious. We must plan accordingly. Understood. Gather the others. We have much to discuss. Yeah, about how you're walking into an ambush like morons? So Lord Silvio's proposal was all a ruse to ensnare me. Unfortunately so. He has been in contact with Esfrost. But he must have surmised that simply bending the knee would not suffice, and thought to use you to curry favor with the Archduke. Using the Prince's leverage? Has he no shame? We can no longer trust anyone. That True. dirty scoundrel played us for fools. True. We made the best choice we could. Had he yeah. refused, he would have attacked us outright. Indeed. There are countless soldiers lurking around the premises. You sure about that? So he came prepared for a refusal. I suppose we can expect as much from the famed opportunist. <coughs> My lord, we must strike before he does. You mean for us to cross blades with Lord Silvio? We have the upper hand now, knowing what awaits. We must do whatever it takes to survive. So the war has already begun. It has. His objective is to capture Prince Roland. Once we are in his territory, 
he will use the surest measure to secure his highness. In which case... Ah, oh, my allergies are off the frickin' charts this morning for no reason. Alright, a little explorable little point. Um, just real fast. I'll go into the encampment real fast. Because I don't know what I did in the encampment in the other one. If I did anything at all. Um, yeah, about that. Just, just in case. And I did promote you. That's right. I would not be here without my. That's what I was thinking. I hadn't done yet. Um, and then we looked at what that was. Um, no harm in buying four of those. I remember, I, yeah, I remember buying more of these, didn't I? I know what I gave her now. I think it was her I gave. Um. Yeah, decreases damage taken when being hit from behind. Or we'll just, we'll give it to her in this one. Okay, yeah, I think that's good. Alright, the part I've been sort of excited for, and that's exploring Tellior's land. We've explored Falks and the side B scenario of chapter 8 right welcome Prince Roland Lord Sarah Noah a beautiful banquet just as I promised no chapter 7 I cannot wait to share a glass of Telior's finest wine with you Likewise, Lord Silvio. We cannot thank you enough for the warm reception. Please, relax, Your Highness. As Lord of House Tellior, I promise to protect you to my last breath. Thank you. You must be exhausted. Why not have a glass of wine? I am sure you will find it to your liking. <laughs> Nobody's drinking. Ah, like nectar from the heavens. I should have expected no less of tell you. Please drink your fill. I insist, everyone. I shall. I have never tasted anything quite so delicious. In honor of the fallen. Cheers to the glory of the high houses. 
he's so nervous and is pushing the drinking. <laughs> I like how Roland turned around to pour a little out to pretend he was drinking. We mustn't let our guard down. I should take the chance to learn the lay of the land. <laughs> yeah, you're gonna need it. <clears throat> oh, right. So what do you guys say, Roland? It truly is a beautiful banquet. One I would have enjoyed were it not a trap. Occasions for celebrations are few and far between at times like these. I hope you are able to enjoy the banquet, even if only for a moment. Lord Silvio still believes we have fallen into his trap. So just take the opportunity to prepare for the inevitable battle head. Drink in hand, of course. I, I am fine. I, I assure you. Why do they spell words weird? They spell, they spell domain weird, assure, jail. This... It's only my third glass. Won't you have another Lord Sharanoa? Oh, it's because she's drunk. <laughs> Convincing now. She's pretending to be drunk. Okay, <laughs> that's funny. I thought, I thought she was just... I thought they were just spelling word. No, she's slurring. I had heard that the Tellier Domain was famous for its grapes, but their wine is far sweeter than I ever imagined. Why did you drink it? Lord Sylvia was truly generous, man. For sharing the bounty of his land with us. It seems the people are unaware of Lord Silvio's plan. Eridor, my man! This wine is something incredible. You can tell the grapes got all the sunshine they needed to grow up strong and sweet. You know, they say a life without Tellior's wine is a life half lived. They're down on fools to spoil such a good drink for their stupid scheme. I didn't think I could walk past them. I prepared only our finest wines for the occasion. Please drink to your hearts and content. The night is still young. Pray, relax, and enjoy the banquet. Yeah, that's how stupid I think he sounds. Oh. Okay. I grew up around Lake Tellur. Looking at it is a way of setting me at ease. <laughs> think a day would come where one of the high houses turned against the other and turned against another and under the guise of an alliance no less never such a thing I never thought such a thing possible what are your thoughts on the matter my lord the trail is not but another path toward victory if it comes down to a fight we must win as lord house wolfhart I have no intention of running from a fight but I would prefer to do it without needless bloodshed this is the path that House Tellior has chosen to walk. Likewise, we must continue down the one we have chosen. Uh, sure, it's one of these two. I thought you might say that, but I doubt they will be so merciful towards us. Pray, leave such needless sympathy behind for yourself and Prince Roland both. Thank you, Anna. I shall take your words to heart. Okay, so... Oh! Okay! <laughs> Sometimes I forget I can move the camera. Yeah, we'll just leave it at that. That's gorgeous. Gorgeous view. Okay, come on. Get down. Ah, so you're Lord Serenu Wolfhart. You, um, hold your liquor very well, sir. Why don't we toast to, uh, how to tell your success? Lake Tellior is the kingdom's water supply, and the dam around it protects Glenbrook from floods. It is the job of House Tellior to watch over the lake and monitor its water levels. We cannot neglect our duties even in the midst of a banquet. I'm sorry, sir. Do you want me to fetch you some wine? You can have my glass. Yeah, you can drink from a lord's cup. 
Okay, why is... Why is this a thing? I mean, I see a dude down there. But why have that specific path? It's just... Not... Viable. Ranged ice stone. <laughs> this lake lies within our domain, but it enriches the lives of everyone at Glenbrook. As such, it is my honor to defend it. You're a citizen. What do you mean? That's bizarre. Oh, I can enter. Nice. Looks like uh, something here. Norzelia volume 5 notes. And 1100. Nice. Nice! Lord Silvio doesn't look it, but he always yearned to make a name for himself on the battlefield. He knew anything to hear the people sing his praises like they did House Wolf Arts during this whole Iron War. Too bad he's a coward. Not my words, everybody else's. I heard that the sweet grapes are for eating and the sour ones are for wine. But why would anyone want to drink sour grapes? Blah. Beats me, kid. Beats me. You'd find none prouder to be a soldier of Talior than my husband. They cannot seem to muster a smile tonight of all nights. I prepared him some warm ginger wine. Hopefully it'll raise his spirits. Yeah, I wonder why he can't smile my words. Because he knows he's got to attack House Wolfort. Not the smartest house to attack, I find you. We are a tough bunch. I cannot scarcely imagine what you must be feeling right now, Lord Sarno. The joy stays between you and your betrothed. Are cut short by the invasion. Lady Frederica must be suffering as well. But together, Telior and Wolfort can set things right. It appears he doesn't know yet about Lord Silvio's plot. Thank you. We must do everything in our power to protect those dear to us. <laughs> I wish I had someone dear to me like you do, my lord. Alas, I am yet a bachelor. I pray that I someday find a woman like Frederica to call my own. You needn't worry. A kind soul such as yourself is bound to find a worthy companion in time. To gain something dear is both a blessing and a curse. You now have something to lose. There are merits to living a bachelor's life. Some say marriage is the beginning, and others say an end. What you say? I'm <laughs> just gonna go with the first one. Jesus Christ! <laughs> Thank you, my lord. You are every bit as gracious as everyone says. I take it that means things are going well between you and Lady Frederica. Indeed, they are. The days we have spent together are regrettably few, but she is now a precious member of my family. Must protect House Wolfhart for her sake as well. I envy you, Lord Zerno. I hope the day I can say the say comes rather sooner than later. I don't know if he's bluffing or what. Weird. I thought I would run into an item by now, but it seems I have not. Are there no items down here? Oh, there's a house down here. And there's an item in the house. Roselia notes six. And 500 coin. There's also one more person to talk to. Oh boy. It's Rufus. The wine here ain't bad. Which is more the rest? 
<laughs> oh my god, I fucked that up. The wine here ain't bad. Which is more than I can say for the rest of this place. That's it? What a man. What a man. Oh. I didn't even see who you at here. It may seem in poor taste to refuse wine on such an occasion, but a hawk rider must be ready to take flight at a moment's notice. For House Tellior to have devised such an underhanded plot means they have also fallen on hard times. I'm not gonna say you're wrong. Okay, yeah, the shimmering I saw must have been about. Uh, I'm not going to say fake, but, you know, from something else. From, like, that light source. Or whatever. That are just bad timing with the sparkles. Uh, I don't I don't think that's actually there in the land. I don't, I don't think the land actually has an encompass embedded in the ground. Just right there, taking up what seems to be, like, three stadiums worth of ground. That is hilarious, though. I think we are done. I should return. Unless Lord Silvio gets suspicious. Tellior's wine truly is a superb. But I think you've had more than your fill, Roland. H Hardly. I, <laughs> I would have another glass or four. <laughs> you have no idea how pleased I am to see you enjoying your domain's wines. But you must be exhausted. Perhaps it's time for you to retire for the night. I I think we should tell you I uh, I think we shall do just that. This way, Roland. I swear I have not had any wine. I don't drink. I don't know why I'm messing up the line so frequently. Hours after the banquet. Prince Roland, are you sure you're not drunk? Hardly. It was all an act. Convincing, no? Cannot let our guard down. The real battle begins now. But of course, I expect they will be here soon. Are they in the house where Rufus was by? I think they are. It highlighted! Alright. Just like before, where we were given Archibald as a recommended member, I think... We may end up giving Jen uh, a try in this one for their spring trap. But mostly for their spring trap. And like before, replace them with Julio. Or maybe even Medina. Just to give her a shot. Just a try. Because I have no idea how useful she could be or will be. But I am thinking more so uh, Jen for the trap thing. But that's just me. I have no need for the encampment. We are of ample level for this. I thought it was going to be a little dirty, but no. It looks like my special wine put them right to sleep. Seize the prince and kill the others to the last.
What? How are you two still moving? It would seem your wine did not have the intended effect. It didn't take a trained eye to see straight through your plan. Your wine found a new home within our breast pockets. Scheming bastards! We could say the same of you. <laughs> I was about to say, that's this rich. This is where you meet your end, Lord Tellior. That's my line, you whelp! I leave the rest to you, Rufus. Well, well. Things, Things are finally getting interesting. interesting. I gotta say, the guy who does Rufus Highness. is very good. We are after you. Understood. Let us carve a path out of here and regroup with the others. Although I don't think it's no secret that Rowan's one of my favorite characters in the game. I think the way his voice actor handles him and basically just goes about his line deliveries is superb. Alright, unit placement. We got the two best friends right here. We'll keep them right next to each other. Why not? We got Frederica and Gila. Makes sense for them to be right next to each other, but at the same time, that's a little risky. Uh, then we got Anna Huet. What? 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 And then we got you three over here. And you three over here. That's interesting. Um, so what I'm thinking is having these three immediately come this way. Like, I'm immediately going to have Corentin, like, use something over here. Maybe Jen throw a tap over here. Speaking of Jen, um, how do I, how do I do this? Do I just click on any random plot? No plot is empty. Shit. There we go. I figured it out. Oh, they recommend Medina for this. Why? I mean, bye bye. You know what? Because this is I'll give it a try as you wish. Sort of throws away my plan, but it works. We'll throw these two over here. Um I kinda need you right here because yikes. I would like to have somebody who like okay, yeah, we need to do that for sure. Um then who's oh that's not good Ooh, that's not good um because we have anna and irador over here they're gonna have to come this way for sure but i want my group to like hold here which means i'm going to need to have these guys come take these guys out I hope that these two can't do too much damage to my girls over here as they try to bust over here and then like I said these guys are just gonna come this way <laughs> Jen's gonna throw a trap and it's gonna be a good old time um, I'm thinking about throwing Medina over here Huet can stay there because she can just fly. So it won't matter. But I'm thinking about switching you. No, it's. Let's switch you. Yeah. I think that'll do well. Ish. Yeah, there we go. Interesting. So the other one was we just had to defeat. Uh, Rufus. This one we have to defeat everyone. So 
skipped frames my ass, you piece of shit. There's no reason for you to skip that frames. And House Wolfort, must we really draw swords against them? Yes. Stop your cowering and fight. Spare no one, but leave the prince to me. I'll kill anyone who gets between us. I'm sorry, my friend. Seems I forced you into another uncomfortable situation. I mean, our decision was made together, Roland. We must have faith in the path we chose. To arms, everyone! Let us cut our way through. Oh yeah, this was one of Roland was on the side of this. I forgot about that. I will end this. Uh, you are gonna take cover. No, you. Stop. You're not moving. You're taking cover, dude. Into the shadows. My turn. My last strike's true. I should yes, it does. Level up, baby. Oh, come on, bro. Time to take flight. From where shall we strike? Um. If I do sweeping slash, that's fine by me. Thought you had me, huh? What are you? Okay. Tell me who to kill. Oh, he's moving. Okay, that's bullshit. Whatever it takes. In turn. So it comes to battle. Um. No, oh, yeah. Shall we begin? I don't want you to go first, though. Be at ease. My thanks. Yeah, you guys really screwed up by forming yourselves like that, dude. I've been waiting for this. I've been waiting for this. No, what are you doing? To victory! Heavens, grant me strength. No, yeah, you you can get over there. I don't. No, you you need to heal yourself because it was bullshit that that fucking guy got to go before you. Shit! Shit! Oh my god, that was hilarious. Oh shit. Suffer. You won't escape. How did you miss? Ugh. No. Not. It's not over yet. Yeah, that was that was kind of bullshit. I'll try this. You'll be fun to kill. Fuck! I almost feel no Damn escape. It. This battle is ours. Take 
Take aim. I'm a fool. I wasn't supposed to. Pretty little. This is so dumb. I'm think there's no good vantage point here. Oh bullshit. What are you doing, dude? So I kept the placement of what I had before. That's so dumb, dude. Personally, I don't think they should let him move. against them stop I'm sorry our decision was that or maybe I should have moved and Frederica My turn. and them to a different spot I won't lose huh They do too much damage. Are you kidding me? Not a victory is ours. But where shall we strike? <laughs> Nowhere. Can't really do anything, bud. Bullshit! Whatever it takes. How dare you go after her? I'll give it my best. Oh. Okay. I know what to do. I'm an idiot. Um, oh, it can only be directly beneath me. Shit. Uh, I mean, yeah, I still gotta do it. Gila, I don't want you to move. That's the thing. Go quick. I'll take 
take you on! Come on! Very well. Not my smartest decision, but whatever. Hey. All I'm going to say, Roland, is it's hard for you to have a turn because I need you as healthy as possible. I'll try this. Forward. I'll make it. I hit the mark. You'll be fun to kill. The hunt is on. Okay. I don't care if it, whatever. Take Bullshit! Whatever it takes. There shouldn't be that fucking many of them, dude. Yeah, you're paralyzed. Screw off, man. I wish I could stand on top of that. <laughs> Lane, heed my call. Oh, bullshit. I'll give it my best. Um... Delays an enemy for a single turn. Aim steady! My time is now. Ooh, wait a minute. If I come here... You can move. I we already know what you're doing. Never mind. I'll take you on. My turn. Um Wait a minute, if I come up here, can I Fuck.
Okay, never mind. For the greater good. Oh, that certainly works. So where shall we strike? You do. Here I come. Not another oh, help you. Oh, bullshit, you can reach me. Let me help. I won't oh, that's your doom. The heavens judge you. I'll heal yourself then. Oh bullshit. I won't let you. I'll take you on. No, you're not Your You're not escaping, bud. My turn. Isn't that I guess You'll not. Be fun to kill. For victory. That deals way too much damage. Um. I'll try this for the honor of House Wolfort. Tell from that great sword. Indeed, I am Serenoa Wolfort. You must be the one they call Heroes Bay. This is much tougher than the other fight. You got that right, boy. And your head will be the next I claim. Cool. Come at me. You can die a hero's death at my hands. Whatever it takes. Wait a minute. I just now realized something. They're not really all that weak to it. Are you fucking kidding me? If I come here, I can't get him. That is bullshit. Fuck! Such bullshit, dude. Behold true power. Um. Oh, you don't get to go to sleep. Wake your ass up. What did I just say? 
Jeez, it's trying to fall asleep on me. Huh? Actually, you know what? No, what are you doing? I want to see what. Not a whole lot. So let's just get her right here and in the turn. I will end this. Sound strike. It's over. This ain't no come at me. Bro. That certainly worked. You guys are constantly healing each other? Um. Oh, no, I don't. Oh, yeah, you can move up here now to think about it. I will end this. Bruh. What the hell's going on here? Are you freaking kidding me? can't hit him but he can hit me oh shit so Anna will get to go before him Oh, no, he won't. He just went. That's right. Uh. Fuck it. Oh, shit. Continue the knife, man. Here I come. Not another step. Do they? Oh, damn. Heaven's 
for victory. No. It's just best to end his turn. I'll show you what I'm made of. Um, yeah, you want to know what you're made of, my man? Uh, a giant HP, <laughs> a large recovery pellet. How can you move? I use Shadow Stitch. For the greater good. Who? Bullshit! I ain't that My turn. You don't stand a chance. The heavens judge you. Yeah, you can end your turn right there. Ha! That tickled. Oh God! Baba bye -bye, Rufus. Damn it! Time to retreat. You whelps haven't seen the last of me. Don't let anyone else kill you before I do. That's not it. We'll just keep you up here for now. Stop healing yourself. Jeez. I'm here to help. For victory. Um. Yeah, you just need to heal yourself. Come at me. Come and get me. Yeah, I need to provoke you because your orders. This will prove useful. Remain and recover? I was about to say, I know you're still down there. For the greater good. Knife. I mean, now that Rufus is gone, it, it's a little more pal palatable. It just sucks that nice. Sarah Noah, Frederica, nice. Angela all died. I guess, to be fair, uh, she was kind of screwed to begin with. Uh, Gila and Frederica both. Oh, can I just like double team you? Let me help. Oh, you missed. I will end this. You would heal yourself. I'll take you on. Sprint, baby. Push on through. Time to take flight. Take 
Yeah. It'd be best for her to do it. I'm gonna lower my defenses on the greater good. Oof, sir. Yes, I did it. You really Fight made a great mistake. Um I don't think there's anybody else. So we're just gonna bring you over here. Time to work. Behold true power. Yeah, right of lightning. Right in front of your face. <laughs> okay, yep. Oh no, you're surviving that. Okay. Okay. Oh, you're, you're hearing yourself. I've been waiting for this. Push on through. Whatever it takes. Charge. Your orders. Oh, there's your orders. Behold, true power. Here I come. Ha! I'm just going to keep sniping you from above. I'll do my utmost. So basically, her way of healing people is just by using items. Okay. My turn. Throw poison. No, I'm just joking. Make yourself invisible. Very well. Oh, I didn't even think I could reach her from here. Fuck yeah, baby. Did it. Now to find Sylvia. Dude, that was a lot tougher than the other one. That battle ain't got nothing where you defend the other one. Like, I'm not going to say that battle was tougher than the, the Avlor one. Trying not to use the fire traps. Or without using the fire traps. Was, that, that was so much harder. The reason, the only reason this was hard was because of... Uh, you're so open. It's so hard to find ground in this map. And not only that, but with Rufus on the move and a hard-hitting monster, you you feel like you can easily get overwhelmed by his strength plus the sheer amount of people he has on this team. No, no, no! How could this happen to me? This foolishness ends here, Lord Silvio. Die with honor. Do not sully the repute of the high houses any longer. And just what good will honor do for me? For anyone? You refused to hand over Roland and received nothing. For your honor, you were attacked, isolated, and betrayed. <sighs> Even if you kill me, nothing will change. Your deaths are inevitable. History will look back and laugh at the fall of Wolfwood, who could not see past their own noses. Are those your final words? No, not quite. Now, Rufus! You'd better pay me, Silvio. As long as I live, so shall the High Houses. Rest assured of that as you go to your graves. What the fuck? One what did almost skip my tenacity? In any case, I am sure we can overcome any difficulties that await us. 
Indeed. Glenbrook shall not fall, and neither will House Wolfboard. Sleep with one eye open complete. All right, that is side B of whether or not you team with Silvio or whatever. So, all right, we'll save the game. Just like I did with Fate and Flames completed, we shall save here for Sleep with One Eye Open completed. Um, so yeah, uh, obviously I get the picture that that's not the true full sight and sight of what's going to happen. But you no, know, that's not the point. The point is to just see the two paths and pick which one you want. That That's the point of it all for me. I'm picking the first one. Um, staying at Wolfhort side A I'm sticking with side A which is a running theme I have picked side A every single time because my original was to do my cannon path first and then choose and then just show the second path um, side of things just that first little part until the end of the chapter because you know there's only one fight per chapter which I find a little weird I wish there was more fights per chapter like smaller scale fights not like big mission fights like i wish you could have the option to do do like mock battles you know throughout the field because the mock battles are there yeah for sure but they're not the same like for example those side stories we watched. All those character stories. Those 10 character stories we watched. How cool would it have been if maybe not all of them. Because not all of them warranted a battle. But how cool would it have been if you got to do battles in those character stories. Like the first one, for instance, where Iridor and Benedict are reliving their memories. Like, that kind of thing. You know, little small-scale battles that don't have, like, Avlora or Rufus-like enemies. But, you know, still have enemies and nonetheless that you need to take care of. Like I said, in a smaller-scale situation. Stakes aren't as high. Difficulty isn't as high. It's not supposed to be. It's just there to kind of bolster you. Get you more familiar. With using terrain. And your characters. In a. A more plot handed way. Mock battles aren't plot handed at all. They're just throwaway mind battles. You know. Training. There's no story to it. Like I wish there was more side story battles what more i wish there was side story battles there aren't any side story battles the only battles you do in the game and the main campaign are main battles you don't do any side ones that i've seen of so far there's only one big battle per chapter that's it so yeah i find that a little disappointing i wish there was you know little side battles that actually held some plot relevance sort of like how they dealt with in uh, three houses I guess what I'm getting at is I wish there was uh, more battles in each chapter than just the one the big one you know Like in this chapter in particular, how cool would it have been if you got to do a little battle on the way to Telior? Like midway to Telior, you get put in a battle and you got to defend yourself. How cool would it have been? Maybe you throw in Rufus into the fight so you can work with Rufus before you got to fight him. I don't know. That's just me. Either way, that is side B of this story. Chapter, you got to sleep with one eye open. <laughs> So, yeah, I hope you have a great day. Remember, you can be the best you can possibly be. If you like the video, give a like, comment, follow me, super special, awesome, subscribe if you haven't, then read me out. Remember, our canon 
uh, our canon playthrough is staying at Wolfort and not going to Talior. So yeah, ta-ta for now.